And again, again Love that's that. too short on that second serve from Guccione. In Bernie earlier in the year. Again, too luck. short on the approach. And Smith was there to gobble it up. Game Smith. Easily put away. Holding to love JP Smith. Two. Game good journey. Oh, terrific return. So, break point for Smith. Big chance. Game Easily Smith. put away. Well played. There's the break. Six games to five. Smith leads. Six games to five. Come out and serve for this opening set. In two set points now for JP Smith. To take it to a tie break. Two set points. Exactly right. Game of first set. It close Smith. it out with haste. Great performance by JP Smith. Seven games to five. Seven the opening set. Five. In our opening match on day two of the Australian Open 2012 wildcard playoff. Game Smith. It's right there, the Gooch covering the net. Oh, look Six at the return three. again. We've seen it time and time Smith. again in this in this match. That point. And there it is. Game seven, Matt Smith. Another great win. Another impressive seven performance five, by JP Smith. Getting the job done in straight sets. 7-5, seven, 7-6 seven, on our feature court. You seem very, very happy with it. Yeah, uh, Gooch played well. Uh, he was seven bombs. And, uh, you know, the main thing today was just to make a lot of returns. And, you know, when the ball went in, make sure, you know, made him uh, hit another volley. Um, it was tough out there just because uh, the ball's bouncing pretty high. And, you know, he has a lot of movement on his serve. So... Just try to take care of my service game and then, um, you know, work on his. You seemed really positive out there. You were really taking the ball early, quite aggressive. Is that something you were thinking about coming into the match? Yeah, I mean, you can't really let his serve get uh, too high and, you, you know, it's got so much spin on it. It's just going to, uh, you know, it's going to be a tough shot to play. So I made sure, you know, I tried to hit it waist height. Uh, you know, any, any higher would have been struggling. So, yeah, waist height was the goal and just, uh, you know, make him play a lot of balls. You've obviously played in America a lot in the college system. You haven't played these guys a hell of a lot. Is it quite different coming out here, Melbourne, outside courts? Is there a big difference between playing here? Yeah, I mean, if you look at the surface, it's, uh, it's, a, little, it's a lot slower than it is in the US. So, And, uh, you know, I haven't really seen many of these guys play, you know, for a few years now just because I have been in the US. So it's good to get that exposure and, you know, play some different people now and then. So, uh, you know, it's been, you know, Melbourne's hold out weather, you know, so it's been good. Something we've noticed is your fitness levels as well. You seem to be out there really comfortable. You can, you know, go five sets if need be. Is that something that's really important to you, working on your fitness? Um, it depends who I play in five sets, you know. <laughs> Maybe five sets in this match, but, uh, you know, it depends who, uh, you know, the game styles. But, you know, um, yeah, but also, obviously you've got to be a fit tennis player, you know. Today's uh, modern game, you know, the balls come back a lot of times, so you have to be willing to hit, you know, 10 to 12 balls. He's a Davis Cup play, and, uh, you know, he probably didn't have a great day today. Um, you know, just like tennis, they're always so, um, you know, you can't, uh, you know, just one match and, uh, you know, I'm sure he'll be ready for the summer. Good luck for your next match. Thank you. Thank you, Adrian. 7-5.